This is Ken from DZ Discs with the new MVP Beaker Disc Golf Bag. This is a satchel shoulder style uh, bag for holding discs. It's marketed as holding 12 to 15 discs. I've preloaded it here. Let's see how many discs it holds for a start. Well, first, by the way, we have the putter pouch on the front. This is pretty deep, it looks like, but when you actually load a disc into there, it stretches out. So holding more than one putter in there will be a little bit hard. You, maybe you can squeeze in two, but really you can hold one putter in, in that pouch. Inside, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I have a total of 11 discs in here, and that's how many I can hold pretty comfortably. Uh, so 12 to 15, yeah, maybe if they're all drivers, pretty common with these, uh, uh, how many they advertise they can hold. It's, you know, based on the thin drivers. You put an average mi mix of discs in there, it's a little bit left, less. I got, I got 11 in here. Uh, let me go ahead and pull these out so I can show you the whole bag. Get the inside of it here. Now this bag is a little unique in that it holds the discs uh, like this, where a lot of the other bags will hold them in, in this direction. Uh, another unique feature is it actually has three pouches. Most bags of this size will only have one divider. This has two. These are removable and uh, and movable, so you, if you don't want one in there, if you only want one divider, you can do that. But when I was playing around with this a little bit, having those three dividers is actually pretty nice. If you're not playing with very many discs, it really helps to keep your discs separated. You have three different pouches and, of course, one on the front for your, for your putter. Let's go over the rest of the features here. Now, of course, this has a shoulder strap. It is adjustable. It has two plastic connection points, so this uh, just can unclip very easily here. Then on the back, you have two additional clip points. Uh, so if you want to hook this into more of a backpack style strap um, or a backpack or attach it to something else, you do have some other connection points there on the back. Back around. Of course, the top is opened with a double zipper with a couple nice pull tabs. Uh, by the way, the total size of this is 12 inches by 8 inches. So it's a fairly small, compact bag for disc golf. Over on this side, we have two just little open pou uh, pouches or pockets right here you can slide things into, and one zippered opening. Covers the whole side, and when stretched out, it's a about an inch and a quarter, inch and a half deep. You got the full side of it here uh, as a zippered pocket. Back to the other side, you have a little Velcroed pouch right here. Unusual on bags like this, mostly it's zippered um, uh, pouches but uh, or pockets, but this one is uh, with a Velcro. And a drink container with a little drawstring at the top. It's lightly insulated there. Originally, I did not think this had a pencil pocket, but it does. Right here on the front, you can hold that up where you can see that. Right there, you got a little pencil pouch right there for your small pencil. Uh, now on the bottom of this, we have some pretty big feet. Give me an idea how big those are. You can see that from the side right there. Uh, that keeps it off, off the ground. Uh, bags this size often do not have feet like this. That's a nice additional feature. If you're setting it down on wet ground, it keeps it up out of the ground. Right now, there are three different colors. We, of course, have the blue, red, and there's sort of an aqua green colored uh, bag as well. Once again, this is the MVP Beaker bag for disc golf, realistically holding 11 to 12 discs.